Fairlock community is mourning the loss of a high school basketball coach. John Williams died yesterday in a car crash on his way to a game. Seven others were involved in the crash as well, but he was the only one to pass away. And tonight we're hearing from those beside him. Take a look. If you look at pretty much any picture you see of him, family of friends, and he's always got the biggest smile on his face. Doug Cornfoot and Rick Fetter coached alongside John Williams for nearly 20 years. <laughs> And he's been with us since. Uh... Described as a larger than life guy, Williams also mentored hundreds of kids as a coach at Turlock High School. I know there's families that would put him on a, a highest of pedestals also for the impact he's had on. The crash happened Friday around 4 p.m. on the corner of Christopherson Parkway and Kilroy Avenue. Turlock PD says three cars were involved and eight people hospital, including Williams, where he later died. Turlock High School later confirmed Williams was on his way to a basketball game. Cornfoot was on his way there to meet him. The call was probably the worst uh, feeling I've ever had. And Fetter was out of town. From the time I got the news and, and got back to town, everything had already transpired. Williams, a larger than life person, a great friend, and an amazing coach who would do anything for his players and his family. Um, and that's just the personality that he had. If you needed something, help, um, he would be the first one there to help you out. Leaving a massive void impossible to fill. Great laugh, great smile, great guy. Just, you know, we're going to miss him a whole lot. Yep. And the GoFundMe page has been set up to help with funeral expenses. No word yet when a service will be held.